Hi, it's great to have YB Ngao coming with us today at Astro Radio News. Welcome, YB. Yes, my so, pleasure. So, first of all, let's talk about your new role in the Devon Rakyat as the Deputy Speaker. The first parliamentary session just ended. So, in this period, you have earned some compliments for being fair and impartial. So, what do you think about this? Are you satisfied with your own performances so far? Uh, first of all, I'm very grateful mm -hmm. for being given the opportunity to serve uh, in the August House mm -hmm. uh, Parliament. Uh, we are committed to make Parliament the pride of our nation. Mm. For now, you seem to have shown like you have been showing your calmness and composure in the Parliament. So, is there another side of YB Nga coming that the members of Parliament should watch out for? Uh, in fact, uh, like what uh, the Bahasa say, tak kena, tak cinta. <laughs> uh, they know me through only through my drama before, mm. though that is not the true Nga coming. Oh, so now, the, when I become a, a speaker, mm. I always remind myself, you need to be fair, firm, and be professional. Okay, so wherever I sit there, it is not only I'm performing my duty. In fact, I carry the trust for the entire nation, because you only have one parliament in Malaysia. We want to do, we want to make parliament, the August House, like what I said, the pride of the nation. Hey, we do not want to have third world parliament. Everyone wants to see a first-class parliament and I believe that we are now on the right track. So now let's move on to talk about the new Malaysia. So now we have a new government. So YB, do you have any expectations from the new government? Definitely. I think expectation is high. Mm. I would say to be precise, expectation is very high. Uh, that is normal. And I believe the new government are committed to fulfill all their election promises. It is important we must give them reasonable time period mm -hmm. okay? and uh, provide the support, mm -hmm. let them fulfill their job mm -hmm. okay? and uh, deliver all their promises. Mm -hmm. uh, but when we talk about New Malaysia, mm -hmm. we have to discard all the old mindset. That is important and it should start from ourselves. Mm -hmm. <coughs> like civic mindedness, mm -hmm. when we say Sayangi Malaysia Ku, when you say you love Malaysia, it's not like just uh, holding your flags, that, that's why. It is meaningless. If you hold your flags in front and then behind you steal people's money. Uh, that is hypocrites. So what we should do is, the government should lead by example. And uh, I think we are on the right track. With uh, Toon's, uh, uh, un he already stated in unequivocal terms that this government is committed to be a clean government. So once the leaders are clean, I believe the subordinate have no choice but to follow. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, and uh, with, with the commitment, the dedication and determination, we shall be able to achieve.